Uh, it was a vital result for you um, at the weekend there. How do you think the team performed overall over the ninety minutes? It was a vital win, obviously. We ended up in the Inverness winning. Uh, it was important we picked up points. Um, we started the game really well, and then we, we conceded a, you know, a farcical goal. Big Chris made a mistake, which happens at times. Uh, no problem with that at all. But we kept on plugging away, and uh, we, we got the rewards with another goal for Simon Benson, which is fifth and sixth games, which is quite remarkable. And then the uh, second half, I think one of the break we looked really dangerous and scored a fantastic goal. Um, great ball with McCarthy and a great finish with Paul McGowan, who I'm delighted for to get his first goal for Akis. He's been performing really well for Akis so far. Um, are you glad you've can you had him in loan? <coughs> oh, we're delighted with Paul McGowan. You know, we left him out the last couple of weeks. Uh, we left him out in Motherwell due to the conditions in the park. We, we changed things slightly. And uh, you know, he wasn't happy about it, and rightly so. And he's answered me back with a tremendous performance last week. Um, Simon Mensing, just to go back to him again, um, he's sort of kind of changed. You've changed his position. Um, had that come from uh, training, or was it something that a conscious decision in your part? Or was it just the way he's performed through training? No, we've changed the whole shape of the team, mm. and uh, I thought that Simon, you know, going forward, you know, he's got a lot of strength about him. when he hits the box. He's got a presence, and uh, you know, so far it's worked. He's been sensational in the last five, six, seven weeks. And uh, he's a vastly improved player. Mm, he does give a lot of muscle up front anyway. Uh, just looking ahead, uh, you've two very important games coming up against Rangers and against Hibs. Um, they'll be very, obviously will be vital to the campaign ahead. Eh? Yeah, it's a huge uh, seven or eight days for us. You know, to, to play Rangers twice and have the Ernie at home as well. Um, we've got two home ties and we have to concentrate on that. Uh, you know, we're slightly disappointed in terms of uh, defensively this week. We've got a few problems. Mark McLaughlin picked up a, a hefty head knock and I don't see him featuring this week at all. Um, and Martin Cannon missed last week's game as well with a slight strain. So hopefully he may come back into it. Uh, David Elliott has been out for six weeks. Um, he played 45 minutes in the reserve game. So he's getting closer and uh, we're going to need him. So what's your options then? Well, the, op- the options are obviously with Chris Wales and uh, we've got Alec Neal. Mm. And uh, we're hoping Martin Cannon and David Elliott are getting closer. And more we'll that this morning. Well, so it's just the, the Rangers game. What aspects will you be looking at going into the game uh, in terms of their side? Is there any players that you will be looking at to sort of you know, keep an eye on? Well, people say obviously the front two, mm. you know, are a big, big threat, and rightly so. I think it's appearing they're as good as anybody in the SPL. Um, but I think it's the service to them that's really important. I think Davis, Ferguson, and Mendes. Mm are a fantastic three in the middle of the park and I think uh, we must make sure that they don't supply the front players and if we can make sure that that doesn't happen and uh, our midfield force the issue then we can create chances at it. And just finally just to talk about the Hibs game ahead of that, do you think you'll be able to sort of answer, they've beaten you twice already this season, you'll be able to answer that this time because you're you obviously a much stronger team than you were last time you faced them. I thought in both Hibs games that uh, it's been a travesty that we've never took anything from Hibs. Mm-hmm. I've not scored a goal. I think their goalkeeper, Mac Alambi, has been the man of the match in the two games against us. And that tells you everything. Uh, and all credit to him. Look at Rob Jones at the back as well. Makes him very, very strong and formidable. But, uh, you know, we're at home. We're on a, a good run. Uh, if we can get something against Rangers, then it'll give us confidence going to get a Okay, thanks very much. Okay.